All right, what's going on guys? It's Juicy B here, and I'm here to talk about a new specialist that was introduced to the PlayStation first. Us on the Xbox and PC players, we will get the absolute zero stuff on the 18th, which is in six days from now. So, with this new specialist, um, the latest news right now, obviously, is that it is OP. New specialist zero, being a crazy girl hacker, is OP because she can not only hack your stuff, she can destroy it as well. So she can either hack or destroy your score streaks and your equipment. And that is really annoying. If somebody can just simply earn a score streak or a nade that automatically just comes just from playing the game, just to destroy your your earned, especially score streaks. I understand the equipment you're gonna earn by, you know, by itself. But the score streaks, you can't just gain automatically. So if those can be destroyed by somebody specialist who gets it on, that's <laughs> a fall off right here. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna land on that bridge right there. It didn't happen, but that's okay. Um, so if somebody can automatically just get their special and destroy your score streak that you've earned, especially imagine, okay, look, imagine you've gotten a gunship. A gunship is the last streak you get in this game, and it's already crazy to get score streaks in this game because it costs a lot. Hell, a, a regular UAV costs what? Six kills in order to get? It's insane. The score streaks take a lot of points to get. Let alone the gunship, the last score streak in the game. So if the hacker zero can destroy your gunship just by simply being in the game, I think that is totally unfair. You know, I understand if maybe the hacking ability came because of score streaks um, or because of a certain amount of kills or something like that. But no, it's it's her special. Like, she gets it by just being in the game. So essentially, somebody could just hold on to that special and wait till the other team gets a crazy score streak like the gunship or the strike team or the attack chopper, or the mantis, something like that. And then she could just choose to activate it and just render your score streak useless. Like, you had no <laughs> no idea what happened. Like, you spent all this time, all this effort trying to earn that score streak. You finally get it, you're super happy about it. And then just poof, like that, it's gone. Like, I think that's totally unfair. The one thing with Zero is yes it takes a long time for you to hack everything and yes you do get a marker on your head when you are activating her special that lets people know where you're at but still man you could be in the very corner of the map and maybe you could even have a coordination thing going on where your team kind of coordinates when you're gonna use zero special and then you know all of you guys can defend her while she's using that it still is pretty crazy and I definitely think it's OP and this is coming from somebody who hasn't even played as Zero. Haven't even gotten the chance to lay my hands on her because I'm on the Xbox. And usually I hold off for saying things are OP until I've tried them. But not only have I heard of how OP she is, I've seen gameplay of her being used and it's just absolutely insane man. Another thing is the amount of points that she gets for her EMP blast is insane. The EMT, uh, excuse me, the EMP nade that she throws has a pretty big radius in my opinion. And if there are a lot of equipment um, or score streak stuff laying around on the ground within that vicinity or in that radius, you could essentially build up a lot of points right there. And that makes it a lot easier for you to build up your own score streak. So I feel like not only does it allow you to get a lot of points, it disables all of that stuff on the ground, such as the razor wire, the torque shield, um, a sentry turret, maybe even an RCXD that's running across the path. So just a whole lot of uses for this hacker in the game that I think are a lot of uh, times OP in a lot of situations. And I'm sure a lot of you guys out there, especially for those of you who have tried her out, who are playing with her right now, can agree that she is overpowered. There might be some counters to her. Um, I personally don't know them, 
I just think it's going to be interesting what Treyarch does to kind of nerf her because I'm sure across the community, across the board, people are saying that she is OP. So she definitely needs a nerf. It's going to be, again, like I said before, interesting to see what that nerf is going to include, how they're going to suppress her. But they definitely need to imp need to do something before she drops for us on the Xbox and PC. So that's just kind of my opinion about that. Imagine getting a gunship. And it just gets hacked. It just gets destroyed. Poof. <laughs> Crazy concept, man. Oh, my God. I just can't believe um, or imagine somebody who actually has had that happen to them. I, I don't even want to imagine that, man. I hope that they do something about um, her OPness. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Let me know your guys' thoughts down below. Thank you guys all so much for the support. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. This is Juicy P, and I am signing off.